Hey y'all, it's your friend D. I got a quick video for you. It's a Dollar Tree fashion haul for those dolls who want to look good on a budget. <laughs> so we got our model here, Tanja. And I was in the Dollar Tree, went to buy one thing, ended up buying several things. And I came across some new fashion in the doll or the toy aisle. So they had, I think it was like five or six but I got these three. Let me see if I can get them all in frame here. And so we're gonna try these on for you today. Uh, the ones that I didn't buy, I'm gonna put clips of them or pictures of them at the end of the video. So here's our first outfit. I'm gonna say she's a pilot. I know some people might say flight attendant or stewardess, but she's a pilot. And it's all one out, one dress. It's printed on uh, so you get see a jacket a vest and a shirt underneath there and the quality of you know it's not that great nothing is hemmed and it's kind of like a plastic material here's the back and I mean it's a dollar 25 can't be mad about it here are the shoes and they were kind of hard to get on and they don't fit that well so yeah i wouldn't recommend those for your dolls her feet are going to be hurting later uh the real reason why i wanted this outfit though is because it came with this luggage and let me see it opens snap shut and we have some faux wheels so i thought that was pretty neat for a dollar 25 at least i got some decent little luggage I'm on the hunt for the five surprise mini fashion luggage. I saw that on my froggy stuff and they look really nice. But this is outfit number one. Let's move on to number two. Okay, here's outfit number two. And except for the glasses, I like this one more than I thought I was gonna like it. So let's take a closer look at it. Like these glasses, y'all, they kind of look like, like those gargles, not gargles, goggles that um basketball players wear yeah so we're just gonna get rid of those and let's see. girl you done broke the company laptop you about to get fired anyway so i kind of like the top i didn't think i was gonna like it but here it is here's the back and i really like the skirt it's just a basic black skirt. It has elastic at the waist. And the shirt actually has a little extra room and it's stretchy. I think this could fit a curvy Barbie. And it has the same shoes as the other one, so I just left the first pair on. But yeah, I actually like this one. I didn't think I would. Let's look at the laptop that she broke. So here we go. How do you open it? Can you open it? There we go. Oh, okay. So yeah, has some detail there, but no screen. So I guess you can add your own, print out a picture or something. And if you really wanted more detail there, you can just probably get a, a Sharpie or a pen or something and write it in. But all in all, it's cute. So let's, you know what? Let me see if this outfit will fit a curvy bar Barbie. Okay, here it is on a curvy Barbie and it fits. Now that skirt's kind of tight. You know, she's a little thick, but all in all, I think it looks really good on her. So I didn't want to try the, the pilot outfit on her. I don't like that one enough to put her through that. So let's go into the third outfit. Here's outfit number three. I was so excited about this one because of the violin. For you who don't know, uh, I am a musician. I have a music degree and I play several instruments. Uh, so when I saw the violin, I really wanted this outfit. Um, well, I didn't want the outfit, I just wanted the violin. But I mean, we gotta look at the outfit anyway. So let's take this off. And the dress 
is, eh, it's nothing to scream about, but it is cute. I wasn't sure if this was supposed to go over her shoulder or hang down. Um, there is a little extra piece of tulle here, but it's a cute dress. It was kind of tight fit, so I don't think this one can, can go on a curvy Barbie. But all in all, it's still kind of cute. And it came with the same black shoes. Now let's look at the violin. This is actually pretty good. So the detail is there. It has the little thumb ring or finger ring for the doll. This was kind of tight, so I didn't want to push it and, and kind of uh, mess up my doll's finger using that. Um, but the detail is pretty decent on this. Eva has the chin rest. Well, it has two of them, but um, has a chin rest there. And the back is not finished, but that's okay. So I might go back and buy another one of these and paint one. And then it came with the bow, and the bow was pretty detailed. Here's the other end. So yeah, I kind of like this one the best. And I will put up the pictures of the other outfits that I did not get. And thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.